Once upon a time, in a quaint little neighborhood lined with well-kept houses and manicured gardens, there lived an old man named Bill. Bill was the oldest resident on his street, known for his gentle smile and a garden that was wildly different from the others. Unlike the neat rows of tulips and roses in his neighbour's yards, Bill's garden was a riot of green in every shape and form, teeming with plants that others hastily labelled as weeds. One sunny morning, a group of neighbours gathered and approached Bill's front gate with furrowed brows. They were polite but firm, suggesting that Bill should tidy up his garden. The weeds look horrendous, Bill, they said. It ruins the view of our lovely street. Bill, leaning on his rake, listened quietly and then nodded slowly. I hear what you're saying, he responded with a thoughtful look. Give me four days and I'll consider your request. The neighbours, puzzled but patient, agreed and went on their way. Over the next four days, they watched curiously as Bill continued his usual routine, watering his garden and tending to his plants, but seemingly making no effort to clear out what they considered weeds. On the fifth day, the neighbours returned, ready to discuss the garden once again. However, as they round the corner onto Bill's street, their words caught in their throats. Where once they had seen only wild, unruly weeds, there was now a spectacular display of vibrant flowers blooming in every colour imaginable. Bill's garden was alive with the bustling of bees and the fluttering of butterflies. More so than any other garden on the street. The neighbours approached Bill, who was quietly observing a butterfly. Thank you for tidying up your garden, Bill. It looks wonderful, one neighbour said gratefully. Bill chuckled softly, his eyes twinkling with mirth. I didn't do anything out of the ordinary, he admitted. Nature took action. What you called weeds were just plants that hadn't shown their colours yet. You see a weed because you didn't plant it. I see a surprise, a gift from the earth that welcomes more life than your manicured beds. The neighbours looked around, embarrassed but enlightened. The weeds they had despised were wildflowers native to the region attracting pollinators and beautifying the once bland street with bursts of life and colour. One by one, they began to understand Bill's wisdom. A weed was only a weed by one definition, but to Bill, and now to them, it represented a surprise, a chance to embrace the unexpected beauty of nature. And 
And so, dear listener, Bill taught everyone on his street a valuable lesson about perspective and patience. Not all unplanned things are unwelcome. Sometimes they bring unexpected joy and beauty into our lives. Good night, little dreamer. As you drift off to sleep, think of Bill's garden, a place where every plant, no matter its name, is cherished for its unique beauty. May your dreams be like Bill's garden, wild and wonderful, full of surprises that delight and inspire. Sleep well, and remember, sometimes the best parts of life are the surprises we didn't plan for.